Thomas is actually starting um, a new advanced manual because he talk, he talked about the entertaining speaker before. But what the members don't know is when you finish your CC, like from C1 to or all the way to the end, C10, there are other training programs. They are called the advanced manuals. But the advanced manual has many different projects. Like for my for my speeches, it's about the entertaining speaker. Whereas for Thomas, he is starting on the advanced manual that is called public relations, which meaning Thomas is training himself to represent a brand or a company for somebody else. And the first and like the CC project, we have C1 to C10. Public relations has A1 to A5. And the first project is called the public relations speech, just to make that correction for everybody. So today, he was talking about a public relations speech for leadership, basically. And if you guys can remember, Thomas had a clear structure. He talked about leadership, about the simple um, aspects of leadership. Like, first of all, it's the simple, of being a leader is you need to have a simple message in your, in your, um, in your ideals. Another thing is you need to know how to observe. You can have a strong idea, but you have to know how to observe other people. And the last thing is you need to have courage. You need to know how to get out there and really do the things that you believe in. And I think as a public relations officer, when you represent a brand, you also have to represent yourself. Thomas' brand, when you hear about Thomas, you think about confidence. He has a lot of confidence on stage. It's not a bad thing. It's really not a bad thing because his confidence carries himself through a lot of things. Like, Thomas made a few mistakes on the stage today. <laughs> it's like a very specific word. <laughs> I know not everybody knows, but I'll, I'll leave that for other talks because it's not appropriate for Toastmasters. <laughs> but even though he made mistakes, you see him continue. He did not let his mistakes okay. hinder him. Exactly. So he kept on continuing even though he fell in the middle of the speech. And also, he's confident enough to pass through any other problem. Because Thomas, sometimes he has a little problem with pronunciation sometimes, but he still talks uh, the best he can during his speeches. Now, for the bad parts. Are you going to get a whooping? Really? You're going you're, you're gonna to get a whooping. I don't care. Sweet. I don't care if you're evaluating me. I'm going to whip you. <laughs> because I, I know, honestly, I've seen Thomas' 10 speeches. And I know Thomas, and he has done a lot better. He is, even though at the first time he's maybe cocky, overconfident, <laughs> but, now, but he's toned it down just a little bit. But today's speech, I think you could have done a lot better than that. Honestly, I know you could have done a lot better than that. I don't, I don't, I think it's a good speech, but you could have done a lot better. Now, first of all, it's, you're not really clear in your speeches, you're not really clear on your points, so people kind of get lost in the middle sometimes. And you have a lot of filler phrases. People have filler words, someone has filler phrases. He has like, hey, I can tell you that. <laughs> yeah, I'll tell you, you know. <laughs> yeah, you didn't know I'm talking about you. Yeah, you know. <laughs> it is good during conversations, but in a speech, try to cut it down just a little bit. Even if you want to use them, make sure that it's natural, it's flowy. I know it's a red card, I know. I've got to kick, kick off. Um, another thing I think you should just relax yourself a little bit more. Maybe maybe you haven't been on stage for a long time, or maybe you haven't talked with a speech in a long time. Try to make it more relaxing. You're talking, you're representing a brand. You're going to be a public relations officer. You've been a PR. So try to feel natural when you're talking about a brand, especially during your next speech. And um, try not to smile when you're talking about a serious message. Or Try not to make a funny face when you're a serious message because like we're talking about yes, everyone needs to be a leader. It's a serious message so you can't just go like, yeah, everyone needs to be a leader. <laughs> <laughs> just try to just make sure you get the right facial gestures at the right moment. But all in all, I know you can do better. But it is a great speech, so just improve on those points and in your next speech, uh, a goodwill speech, it's gonna be better. Okay, look forward to your next name. Hopefully I'm not the evaluator again. <laughs> 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 <laughs>